Hey guys, Tom from Lush Shell here. Today I want to talk about the Nike product testing program. This is a program operated by Nike. It's on their official site and it's a program that'll send you out free shoes and clothing and I promise it's not a scam. You don't have to pay any money. And if you ever watch my videos right in my work, you know I'm 100% honest. So in today's video, I want to talk about how you can apply to be a tester, how you get approved and what happens if you do get approved. If you want free apparel, free shoes, you want to test it out and help out the company, then this is a program to uh, check out. It's not something that's gonna pay you, but it's more so in my videos that's gonna give you freebies. So with that being said, let's jump in and begin. So the first thing I wanna talk about is what is this program? So as part of this program, you're gonna be asked to try out shoes or other related gear and simply report back after wearing it for a certain amount of time, usually about eight weeks. They're not just gonna give you the shoes for the heck of it, because the whole point of the program is to prove their products. That's why they created it. So depending on your demographic profile, Nike will usually send your gear based on your activity. I'll get, on, get into this later here. So for example, if you're a weightlifter, they would wanna send you shoes related to lifting weights. But if you're a runner, they'd send you running shoes. Your demographic profile is generally what will get you approved so they're looking for specific people but I don't know which demographic they're looking for just keep in mind that if you do get accepted to the panel you'll have to do some work in exchange for your free shoes and in most cases you'll be asked to return everything you receive so they can study the usage so almost always you'll be asked to answer a variety of questions based on your wear and tear and usually you don't get to keep the shoes with apparel you can so generally as long as you answer your questions or provide in-depth answers there's a pretty good chance Nike will want to continue working with you so if this sounds like something of interest, I want to show you how you can sign up. And what you're going to do is just go to the website. I'll link in the description, voiceofathlete.nike.com. And you'll go to the bottom. There'll be three options here, depending on your age. You'll have 18, 13 to 17, as well as 12 or younger. Yes, your kids can sign up, but if you're going to apply as a minor or a child, you're going to need your parents' permission as they will have to fill out the profile as well. And what's going to happen here is when you click on that apply button, so for example, if we go to the adult testing, it's going to take you to an application and they're just going to ask you where you reside, what kind of products you want to test, if you want to test apparel only, and so forth. It's really up to you what you want to have sent to your doorstep. Throughout this application, you'll need to talk about your interest, your weight, your height, apparel size, and so forth. Toward the end, you'll then need to create a username and password, as well as sign a release waiver in order to put yourself into the company system. The whole process took me about 10 minutes, but in some cases, you may get an error message that'll look something like this. It'll say we're not accepting new applications, but don't fret. They usually open these applications up occasionally, so keep checking in you know, every week or so. Anyways, if you're able to get into the application process and everything, and after you complete it, then you'll receive a message that looks something like this. It'll say, congratulations, your application has been submitted. And then you'll be notifi notified by email for the sport category you apply to. So for example, you apply to basketball, then you get basketball related items. And in that case, they'll give you emails and what comes next. So now it's just a waiting game. Once you apply it, all you can do is wait. Nike will either deny your application or you can get the gear, but you're just gonna have to wait for a product testing opportunity. And what will happen is it could take weeks or months. From what I read, it usually looks like they're looking for active act athletes. The main reason they ask you a bunch of questions regarding your lifestyle, specifically the sports you play. So if they, if they feel you can push your gear to the limits, then there's a good chance you're going to get approved. However, on the flip side, if you're a 40 year old businessman who just walks around to the office all day, then you're probably going to get denied. So usually if you're playing a lot of sports, you're practicing and playing games, say you're on a high school football team, college football team, baseball team, etc., then your chances of getting approved are pretty good. You're just going to have to look out for the emails. It's hard for me to say, but that's what I've read in the past. So as long as you fit, again, a highly active lifestyle, your chances of getting an approval email can be quite high so if you do get free gear what happens now what will happen is that you will get a box package in the mail and it'll have a, a piece of paper it'll look something like this and there's a security policy that your shoes must be only worn for casual wear or directed by your analyst you cannot wear them to high profile events with photographers you cannot share any of this information on social media you can't take pictures of anything they send you it has to be very very top secret you'll always need to return the shoes once you're done with them and inside the box they'll give you a shipping label and they'll tell you when to send it back usually it'll be about eight weeks as i mentioned prior and then you'll need to keep a log simply Put them. This means that you're just going to have to record a journal twice a week or so whenever you're wearing the shoes. So picture is a journal like you want to look at when you're done. So for example, you say Tuesday I ran five miles in the rain. You just want to be detailed because they're going to take these shoes and look at the wear and tear. And this is going to be the due diligence for them to make sure that they're creating a shoe that's going to last in high endurance situations. And again, you're going to have to make sure that you don't take photos, nothing. You can't even talk about it. You have to keep it to yourself. Generally, as long as you follow these rules and you offer good feedback, return your gear as indicated. They're going to keep you in the database. They keep sending you freebies. Once you screw up, you're going to get in trouble and get banned from the company. And in some cases, they could take legal action. So you want to play it safe if you go about. 
So before I wrap things up, I just want to give you a couple tips here to keep in mind. Your age to be eligible, you can be anywhere from 18 to, to as young as 10. But remember, if you're younger than 13, you do need a parent's permission. Also, the location, it's open to all U.S. residents, but it is open to other countries as well, including Mexico, Canada, and China. Be sure to read terms and conditions to know which countries are being accepted. And Another common question is how long does it take to get these free shoes and apparels? It could take weeks, if not months. Sometimes you'll never get invited, sometimes you'll never get anything. So that's something to keep in mind. And lastly, does Nike pay cash? No, you'll never get cash. In reality, you're just testing out the shoes for a few weeks and offering your opinion. And sure, just picture this opportunity if you want free Nike apparel. So that's going to wrap things up. This is a great way to test out Nike shoes or apparel for a limited amount of time. As you can see, you have to put forth some effort. But if you want to rent some pretty cool Nike shoes for the time being to help a company that you like, why not? Just sign up. takes a couple minutes. And if you don't like what you see, just ignore the invite emails, delete your profile, and that can be done. So in the in the, in the end, it's, it's a reputable program and a lot of people are part of it. In fact, you might not be able to apply for a while because a lot of people do apply. That's going to wrap things up for now. As always, go to LushDollar.com to find the many ways to save money, find free things like this, make money, and so much more. I continue to add content and videos. Like, comment, subscribe, all that helps me. That's going to do it for now. See you guys next time.